Hi, Bruce from Safari. And as you can see, uh, this customer's doing Oz. And we're gonna meet him when he comes to pick up NPS 4x4. We've got here beautifully done in this sandy top. And uh, we've got this side here is uh, got all the toys in the back. I'm going to show you in a minute. This is a general area. Starlink's going over there. That's why that uh, wire's hanging loose. We've got our inverter there. But let's walk around the other side. And uh, this is the first truck we've done with two Scotties in it. Uh, there's a photo of the toys set up here. And yes, that's an outboard uh, motor there. And the boat is on the top with a winch, a 12 volt winch. So what we've got in here is uh, Scotty uh, 24 to 48 from the alternator and that's a 48 to 12 because this boat winch up there that you can see uh, will pull up to 120 amps. And so uh, a normal DC to DC just won't have enough grunt for that. So we've got all three voltages in the truck, all anchored off the 48 volt. And now we're gonna see the power out of the truck. Start up, Cam. So when we first start up, you can see here the power's going in to the, to the starter battery. And now it'll start to, when it goes negative, it's starting to pull the power out. There we are, folks. We're getting 3,400 watts out of a 3,000 watt Scotty. It's because the alternator in the front is 180 amps at 24 volts. And on this NPS truck, that's a hell of a lot of charge. So you can see here, what's going into the battery here. So that will char fully charge these batteries in probably, I'd say, an hour and three quarters from, say, 20% to 90, even an hour and a half. So very, very high-speed charge. Here Thanks, we are man. now at just uh, tad up on the idle. It's uh, not even high idle. And so this will go around two kilowatts at idle. So this is the ultimate uh, solar backup and uh, it's just an incredible performance and it's not even getting warm. I can just keep my hand on that. I've got to say, how good's that?